because you're not the problem. You didn't do it. Someone caused you to do it. That means you're not the problem. If you're not the problem, you have no remorse. See the cycle? See the CI goes in a circle? Vicious cycle, and it continues over and over and over. One of the primary reasons for that cycle to continue in the Filipino mind or anyone's mind is that because somebody else is, is, is the problem, and it, it, that's a form of escapism. They know they really, deep down in their mind and their hearts and their spirit and soul, they know they're the problem, but they don't, they don't want to own up to it. And it, they want to escape from the fact that they have a problematic nature. They want to escape from the fact that they deal with some issues that they really can't deal with. And so that escapism allows them to uh, uh, come away or de uh, pull back from reality and get into a world of escapism where they can deal with uh, not the real issues, but the issues they want you to see. It's a toxic relationship. It's a toxic mentality. They're escaping from reality, shifting the blame on you for what they did. That has a tendency to justify their behavior. Okay? When you find somebody like that, man, it's hard. And you sometimes you never know that that's really them until you get down the road in that relationship. And then it comes out more and more. Because when a person is lacking accountability, sometimes because they like you, whatever, they're going to do whatever they can to stay in good grace with you. But once they got you, the whole, all the mess starts coming. Everything becomes to do what? Get unraveled. And the more you deal, the more you stay with, the longer it becomes more what? Unraveled. Because they can't accept the actions that they do. Yeah. They can't. They accept the good stuff. But the bad stuff? No. I didn't do that. You caused me to do that. It's your fault. Yeah. How crazy is that, man? But people do it every day. Lack of accountability. The Filipino doesn't feel bad for the bad thing they say or do. It's a lack of remorse. Yeah. It's a license to continue in everything they want to say bad, everything they want to say uh, nasty, mean, and any vicious, vile act. Yeah. Because I'm not proud. You are. I did bad because uh, you made me do it. The way you said, if you hadn't said what you said, if you, if, who cares what, what someone said? You were responsible for what you did. Nobody else did it but you. Whether you feel somebody motivated you to do it or not, who did it? Come on, let's be grown men and women. Let's go up. But the problem is this. When you have a Filipino that lacks accountability, that's a sign that they're not what? Mature. They can't own up to what they did or what they didn't do. They're not serious enough to see that this issue is reflective of their character. And one who does not understand that their personal character is reflected in their action is immature. Because children get on the floor and have a tantrum when they, you know, yeah, they can't get what they want. And they you think they're feeling remorse now. You know why they don't feel remorse? Because you didn't let me get what I want. It's not me, it's you. You, you, you should have gave it to me, mom. Yeah, crazy stuff, man. But that's what you're dealing with. And you never know that aspect. Sometimes you never know that aspect of a person until you actually deal with them on a long-term basis. Okay? Okay. Number four, get ready about this. Though. We won't be long. They have no shame in their game. Hmm? They get a pass. You know? You allow, when you allow this behavior, ladies and gentlemen, when you allow this behavior from the Filipino, from your children, from anybody that's in your life, significant other, it's going to cause issues. Because you're giving them a pass in your mind, in their mind, for them to do it what again and again and again. You get away, get away with it once, you want to do it again. So what you gotta do, you gotta stand up, you gotta man up. Now, you gotta deal with your issues. You gotta deal with your responsibility. You, what you did is what you did. Okay. And, and you gotta put that on them constantly. You gotta make them see the reality of what they did. Because in their mind, they did it because of you. And that, that uh, justifies their actions, what they did. Whether it was good, bad, ugly, whatever. Yeah, real quick, real quick, real quick something. And then, yeah, uh, they have no consciousness. A person that never has accountability for anything has no conscious desire to, to claim what they did, to own what they did because of their immature level. Right. It's a vicious cycle. When you allow them to uh, own up, don't not own up to the things they did, not be accountable, they will continue that over and over. Because you give them a free pass. 
You have to check people. You're not gotta broadcast about how you put the Filipino in check. You gotta put put your Filipino in check. The Filipino doesn't feel bad for that thing. We're talking about that. They don't feel bad for what they say, what they do. They have no moral compass. They have no conscience, and they don't care. And they have no shame in their game. No remorse.